Welcome to Parkgate Leisure guys Please give us a thumbs up if you like these videos um, Do have a look through my others uh, Just just going to start this off saying we don't put prices on our videos because things do change uh, You never know we, we might actually put a price down one day um, So if you want to see prices and current stock, please do go to the website parkgateleisure.co.uk um, But excited today. We've got a rear lounge Swift here. What's particularly nice about this van is we've had it before so sold this van three or four years ago um, it's come back in in part exchange still in really good order so we are pleased to offer it again uh, so we've got some good tires nice painted front bumper little bit of cracking on the paintwork there but not particularly visible from uh, a meter or so a little bit of flakiness on the the bonnet it looks like there's a couple of extra stickers being put on there but um, we'd paint that if somebody felt that it was um, too disappointing for them to part with their cash and buy we'd be happy to sort that um, the decals on it are a little bit faded but certainly don't warrant replacement but generally the outside of this van's in good order um, nicely presented not being clattered and knocked about um, I'm afraid it's parked in the bushes. I should have pulled it out, but uh, we've got loads of videos to try and do, so we are struggling to uh, to get through them quick enough and get these vans presented for you. Um, could do with a little wash off, but it's not horrendous. This is as it's arrived. But the important bit. Let's have a look inside. Oh yeah, you can see we've got a wind out canopy up there. Um, as I mentioned, it's a rear lounge van, so look at that. Uh, Lovely rear lounge, lots of space. Um, do remember, there's no seat belts in the back. Vans with a rear lounge generally don't have seat belts in the lounge. If they do, they're often um, aftermarket fitted. Um, but there, loads of space. This bed here, this to make the bed, this pulls out to there, which does make a bed that's four, four and a half foot wide. Probably four and a half foot wide, actually, with an extra bit on here. Um, I mean, the, the joy with these is sitting in the back, looking out these windows at the views. Uh, obviously, they're um, not very good here, but this is a showground, not a lovely campsite. Um, kitchen area, you've got space for your TV there. Uh, loads of paperwork. Um, drinks cabinet above. Again, lots of cabinets around in here, so loads of storage. Uh, into the kitchen area. Um... Typical typical British van with a four burner gas hob, grill, oven below, pan drawer at the bottom. You've got a cutlery drawer here. One of these slidey outs just there. Um, that's not the original chopping board for the sink, but somebody's done a reasonable job. Fridge. Three-way fridge, as with most vans. Um, you've got um, a gas... Oh, the, the heater down there which is a gas fire also runs on 230 volt electric and this fan does also have blown air so you can have the air blowing out over there also into the bathroom which does make that a nice warm place uh, your freestanding table of course that goes inside in here in the lounge but it also doubles up as an outdoor table because it's completely freestanding um, in your bathroom so swivel top toilet so you can swivel it this way and have plenty of room for your knees or if you're going to have a shower you can move it that way shower cubicles just over there or the shower head sorry that pops up just there um, front seats they're in good order there's a bit of muck on that one a little bit of wear on the bolster and a little bit more wear on the driver's side bolster, as you might expect. Uh, curtains for the cab. And up here we've got your over cab bed, which that's in the not used position, so you've got plenty of room to get in and out the cab. That is with the extension flap down. You've also got a little wall you can pop up to... Uh, stop anyone from falling out of bed large or small you've got the two mattresses there so the top one 
you just grab this tab pull it across you've also got your ladder there as well um, but uh, nice space up there with windows at both sides a shelf up there so you've got somewhere to put all your bits and pieces so you've got access to this shelf up here your control panel all nice and simple um, so there you go guys if you like come and have a look see what we can do um, and if you've got any questions comments please leave them below but thank you very much for looking bye for now